for this whole swap, manual swap. I'll be back. The mic's died. So, come back to the channel. Um, as you can tell on YouTube thumbnail, I got some coming for the Lexus. Finally, we finally getting some power. You guys should see my room. I've been stacking parts, uh, getting parts for about like a month, month and a half now. I'm almost done with getting all the parts. Almost everything gets in here. Probably the end of this week, beginning of next week, I'll get all the parts. So I'm going to start the swap. My goal is to make it to a competition in Reading in March. So hopefully we can make it. That's the goal. Um, other than that, let's get everything set up so you guys can see what I got. And hopefully y'all like it. I know a couple people are not going to like it. But some people are. Some people are not. Let's see what happens. As you can see, my room's been filled with parts for a while now. I'm excited. I'm just happy it's actually hella warm out today too. It's nice out, sunny. It was been, the weather been super ugly these past couple days. Oh look, I broke my side mirror a couple days ago. I've been meaning to get it replaced and it's been raining crazy. I don't see no mold, so that's good. And that door's all messed up. I have to put a jacket on top so I don't leak in, for real. But hey, it happens. Let's see if this one starts, man. Oh, shit, I gotta put the clutch in here. Man, all reliable, for real. So this whole swap, manual swap, is gonna actually go on back my blue car, my daily. So it still live on, but in a different chassis. Everybody think I should swap that car, but the thing is like, this car is super bright. Like I want to, like you know, I want a street car. You know, I want something that's not bright. I can chill in this five speed. If I leave this five speed, swap the other one. Let's swap in the IS. IS. I'm gonna call this the LM series because this is not an LS, it's an LM. LM7 to be exact. Um, yeah, excited. I've been always a American guy at heart. So I know a lot of people, like I know a lot of JDM people were telling me to turbo the IS. I was planning on turboing the IS, but honestly for what I'm gonna do to the IS and turbo it, it's more, I feel like more of a headache. Uh, I don't know, maybe we're gonna find out. but. I'm almost done with all the swap parts, and luckily I know a lot of LS people, so I've about I'm about like 4,800 into the swap right now, and um, the goal is to make about 350 at least, at least 350 to the wheels. Uh, so that's the goal on the healthy cam. Um, so I have all the parts right here. I'm gonna scoot you guys over in a little bit, but I'm excited. I'm excited. Do you guys not understand how excited I am? I've been an American guy at heart. Like my brother, my twin brother has a CTSV one cam. That shit's amazing. And now I'm going to have it's what's well, a mild cam. I'm doing the comp cans, uh drift cam NSR. NSR I think no springs required. Yeah. NSR drift cam. Uh it's not that hard of a lobe, so it won't be hella cam. But it's gonna be it's gonna be nasty though. Know? Coming from this car, coming from this car right here, coming from this car, tell me come on, tell me it's not. And you guys might be thinking, Rob knows how to LS swap? No, <laughs> no, I don't. So we're going to learn together. But I'm, I'm going to try. There's a couple people, like, uh, I, I think I'm about to upload a video. No, this is going to be after, but I met uh, some guys, Psychotic uh, Street Builds, uh, TJ and Daniel, that are pretty much going to be helping me a little bit on the swap because they already done the LS swap on IS. So they'll be giving me some tips and tricks and stuff to see how it goes. So I'm excited for that. Um, 
other than that, yeah. Uh, five threes out of a O2 Suburban that uh, Pops helped me from Richmond Tire helped me get. So thank you to them. And then I got pretty much the whole swap here. I'm just waiting. The only thing I'm still missing is the uh, Melling's old pump. Um, and the LS1 front accessories from my F-Body Camaro or 2002 Camaro. And then that's pretty much it. And the fuel lines and the power steering lines. That's it. Other than that, everything else I got for the car. Oops. I'm just excited. I hope you guys are excited as I'm excited because I'm excited. The goal is to finish for LS Fest. I know I said the writing come earlier because if I would have said LS Fest in the beginning of the video, you guys would have known that it's a LS or LM swap. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm excited. So I'm going to show you guys what parts I got. Let's get to it. So let's go. So first things first, we got the MSR drip cam. Some pump cam. I'm pretty excited. I don't want to open it because I'm, I don't know, I'm scared of opening. Um, other than that, since I got the um, Moroso front sump, uh, that's what I got to do so it can fit the uh, LS, the LS can fit on the front subframe where I have to modify the subframe and I wasn't trying to do that. Um, so I got a Moroso front sump pan which has to go with the GTO pickup tube, I believe, because the GTO, I guess, has a, a pickup tube in the front of the motor for the swaps for the LSs. So I went with that. Um, I'm also going to be doing a Chase Bay uh, ABS Elite. I'm going to be doing a separate video for you guys for that so you guys can see how it goes. Um, I'm excited for this one too. Um, also, I got Chase Bay's upgraded uh, slave cylinder. I had to. Not had to, but just in case if I do go T56 eventually. Because well, right now I'm doing CD09 because it's pretty cheap. Oh, I don't even have the trans back there. I should have put the trans in the picture. Doing the CD09 uh, with Fabbot uh, accessories. So we'll see how that goes. Why are we getting interrupted mid video? Look, look at this. Hi. <laughs> you can't just record normally, huh? No. I was in the middle of a vlog and, <laughs> and then they pulled up deep. <laughs> Hello, motherfuckers came. Like, damn, I'm just trying to, trying to show. But I'm swapping the LS, man. But anyways, I'll just show it like this. So we got LS7 style lifters from Michigan Motorsports. Um, LS7 trays. We got the, what's this called? Pickup tube holder. So, cause you know how only, only one side holds and sometimes it, it wobbles. So you lose oil pressure and we don't want to blow that up. We got excessive short shifter, every mount. Are we back? The mics died, so. Other than that, what we got in other box, we got fuel pump, we got fuel pump, raw bore, I think 255, uh, we got excessive motor mounts, because I already got the excessive mounts on that one, um, other than that, what we else we got, we got the Moroso that goes with that, um, we got the, oops, I mean, what is this called, bro, I'm just getting new to LSS, so if I say things that you, doesn't make sense in my bad. Oh, this is the chain double roll, I think. I forgot what it is. Oh, crank spot, whatever. 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 That. We got car plug wires. Oh, this is the one I really want to open. I haven't opened it yet. Uh, yeah. Oh, let's show you guys the trance too. We got the trans over here sitting, bro. I've had this shout out Angel, bro. I've had this trans for she's probably like like four or five months, probably longer than that, honestly. And then the heads, I got two forty three heads with Texas Speed uh, springs, six six sixty springs. It's a little bit stronger spring than what I'm going with, but I'd rather have it more reliable than anything. And then we got Hector over there doing his shit. Shout out Fatbot. Well, we'll see. They took a while to respond. We got in here, man. We got in here, man. We got in here. Box number. How many boxes are there? It's two boxes. We got in box one. Box one, we got clutch, lines, throwout bearing. I mean, this is a slip. Uh, 
pilot bearing, not throttle bearing. This is throttle spacer. There's a uh, there. We got flywheel bolts with the clutch thing, whatever, alignment tool. I believe these are the transmission hardware and gaskets. I gotta find out where those gaskets go. On the adapter plate. Right. If you guys don't want to do the the Collins adapter kit, Collins is like, sheesh, I feel like Collins like double the price on this. This is like 400 for kit, so I'm excited. Let's see how it works. Other than that, yeah. I'm excited. I'm excited. And then this cart's. We'll be taking out this car. And this is just a stock 2J with headers and <laughs> aluminum radiator. That's pretty much it, honestly, for this car. Thinking about it, and then it just. This car is bought, not built. Yeah, I bought it. Literally, it's bought, not built because I didn't pretty much touch it. The only thing I've done is suspension. Suspension. BCs on it. How's it look? Drift HQ spacer. Uh, extended Ooh. lowers by Colin. Colin Fabs, and then the yeah, rear. It's, it's just full KFD. That's about like three years old, clapped out. Zero 09 subframe bushings. MBRZ rear differential. And that's, it. that's it. No power box, honestly. And then I'm on like four rear ends. But it's okay. It works. So yeah, I'm excited as you guys are. Also forgot to add, by the way, it's gonna be LS6 intake manifold with injectors and fuel rails, and then dedicated motor headers, long tube headers I'm gonna get, and then LS1 everything already said for accessories. So, so yeah, he's making hella noise. But yeah, that's the end of it. Pretty simple. Most of the car already has everything I need. So like I said, it got suspension and then the interior is pretty, you know, normal. Other than that, I do need to get a full cage uh, for if I want to do the F, FD. Well, if I want to do the FD competitions too, but if I want to make it for LS Fest comps. But yeah, other than that, so yeah uh, by the way if there's any companies or anybody that wants to reach out help me out give me tips pointers something that can make the process a little faster because i do have about like two and a half months to at less fest um i would appreciate it help would much be appreciated and if you guys want to be on the car while for at less fest just shoot me a dm or an email i'll leave the email at the bottom and um yeah other than that i appreciate you guys for watching like i hope you guys like subscribe and comment share and see y'all